Hi guys, it's me again. I reached the second castle for today, which you will get in a, a separate um, video. What's going on here? You see, it's very warm. My hair is doing whatever it wants to, so <laughs> excuse me for that. Um, I reached the next castle. It's called the Rosenburg, the castle, uh, the Rose Castle, basically. Uh, what I will do, I will just sit down for a minute, eat my lunch, and then I will conquer the castle. So that's not the front of the Rosenburg. I thought I was here with the school once, but I can't remember it at all. So I told you, maybe it's still a new one. View from one end to the other. And then we will go in. Fortunately, I have to pay for it, which I don't like at all. But not everything is for free. It's so pretty already. I'm quite sure I was never here before. I really, I could have sworn I uh, was here with school, but I definitely wasn't. Can't remember any of it. So the plan is now I have 20 minutes left, then I will join a tour because you will see a few rooms that you can't see on your own, which I want, I want to see everything. After that, I have another ticket for a Falcon show. So it's about 45 minutes where we will see the Falcons go for the hunt. Maybe there are owls or eagles or whatever they have on animals here. And after that, I have another hour to walk through on my own, which I will definitely need. But I'm quite excited. I thought there's much more going on here, but I think it must simply be the weather. It's just way too warm for people coming out here. But I think it's usually a very a popular castle here. But who cares? I have it for my own again, <laughs> for myself. Also lovely, all those coat of arms up there. I, th I see it, a few of them are from the counties in Austria. I don't recognize all of them, but I'll probably get an explanation during the tour. So a little look around here in the garden, the courtyard. This is where I came in. You see all the roses along the walls here. That's probably why it got named a Rose Castle. If that's a reason, I will learn later on. The gardener is out here too. Otherwise, can't see another soul. Which means I'm probably alone in the tour. Well, let's see. Here you see the entrance a little bit more detailed. It's a beautiful Renaissance style. Tower on the top. Roses all around here. It really looks pretty. Let's see a few statues coming along here. There's a little tavern in there. It's probably where the tour starts. It's so cute. It's really nice. And see the view back. Such a good idea for, of me to come along here. It's also a cute wee garden. Just before I really go in, and another one on the other side, which looks quite romantic, I have to say. So if I would feel alone here today, I would have sit down here for a while. It really is a perfect little Disney castle, isn't it? Just wait, wait for it. And here we go. I love it. I love it, it will be amazing. And I'll probably have a little ice cream afterwards. It's warm enough for it anyway. Even more roses when walking along the way here into the other part. Uh, a beautiful pond is down there. And there is a castle kitchen just there. But I guess I will see it during the tour. But I'll have a walk in for it afterwards anyway. So you won't miss out on anything. By now I think we can hold up with the castles in Scotland. I mean these are a few pretty amazing old buildings here. So I just finished the, the tour we had here 
uh, took, uh, took us about an hour. This here is the oldest part of the castle. This is really the medieval part of it. Uh, the rest was uh, rebuilt uh, to it or built to it and the Renaissance time. But I can't stay here for long because in about 15 minutes we will see the falcons, the eagles and whatever uh, there is to come. So I'll have to hurry but I'll come back later. So the falcon show will start in about 5 minutes and it will be just out here. So guys, I hope you enjoyed the falcons, the eagles, the uhu, yeah, the old, the big one. Uh, it was fantastic, such amazing animals. I'll have another hour and about 20 minutes left, so I will go inside again and I'll see if I can find something new for you and me. So I found the a library for you and for me, of course. Uh, uh, the ceiling is original. 16th century, wait, let me see if you get it right. Uh, yeah, 16th century. This was also used as a music room and a ballroom, and now it is the library. Unfortunately, I'm not allowed to go in, but as we all know, we love a few frescoes. You can see them up there. And books are in those cupboards. Really, really love this room. This is the marble hall. You can also see the coat of arms of the family Hoyos, who owns the castle at the very back, above the fireplace. And you can also rent the room for weddings, or receptions, and other events. So I have to remember this in case if I ever marry. <laughs> well, I always have hope left. Yeah, that's the entrance. Beautiful. And here we have the assembly hall. And of course, every castle needs a balcony. And the balcony is here with a gorgeous view over the valley, little river down there, a few houses somewhere along the way. This little town is not very big, same as the one before, Grellenstein, quite small. But if I have such big castles, you don't need much more. So I'm on my way to the medieval kitchen. No medieval, a uh, castle kitchen. Let's say castle kitchen. It looks quite lovely in here. The pond is here again. We have some goldfish in there. At least I can see one. And we're going in there. So the kitchen is here with a bit of a more modern twist. One of the ovens here still work, I just read on the information plate. Oh, that looks more like medieval style. Nothing in here but the old stone.
Also here at the very end, a little rose garden, which fits to the rose castle. So people, I think that's it. I only have less than half an hour left. Nobody's around anymore, so I hope I'm not the last one. But I have to make my way uh, to the, uh, the exit, and that's me for today. So I hope you enjoyed both the videos at uh, Castle Kleinstein and with Castle Rosenburg, my uh, Rose Castle. Uh, it's quite romantic here, so well, off to work soon again, and hope you're all alright. And you'll survive the heat. I mean, we at least we try, you know, sort of. Yep. So, see you soon. Bye bye. Yes, you need one last look of the rose castle here and it's really so beautiful it's really worth coming along here i might do it once every year it's really really beautiful and i had a fantastic day even with this hot weather